inspiration this morning. Girls around the globe will begin singing, jamming, and drumming as girls rock camps everywhere kick off Monday. Bringing this experience to cities around the world is not easy, but a St. Petersburg musician made it happen, and that's what makes Rachel Sibelia a great inspiration. Girls learning to play instruments, writing original songs, even forming their own bands. The international movement Girls Rock is coming to St. Petersburg, teaching girls how to come together using music. To create a band and to create something completely organic, you have to work together to reach that. A band is a community. It might be a small one, it might be a really big one, but nonetheless, it's a community in and of itself. So we all work together to show them how to communicate effectively. This girl band, 76 Cut Short, formed at Girls Rock St. Pete last year. The girls first thought it was all about learning music, but were quickly overwhelmed with other feelings. Being empowered and being comfortable. The camp just kind of helped me open up a little bit. Exactly what Rachel Sibelia hoped would happen when she worked to bring Girls Rock to Tampa Bay, a venue to help girls to learn how to take up what she calls space. Take your space. Take it because it's there and no one is going to allow you to do that. You have to do it for yourself and that's what we push through camp is be loud, be heard, take your space and do what you want to do with your life as long as you're good to other people. Teaching young girls to find their voice through music is what makes Rachel Sebelia a great inspiration. Well, 20 girls showed up at the St. Petersburg Music Factory for Girls Rock St. Pete the first time the international camp was held in the Bay Area last year. This year, enrollment has doubled. So if you'd like to learn more about how to get involved, head to WFLA.com. This is not for profit. A lot of 